happy people i'm back with another video and today i have a different type of bath and body works video um in my previous videos i've mentioned that i want to try and do a no buy for the year of 2020 so that's what i'm here to talk about with you all today i want to introduce the idea introduce the topic of a no buy year so typically when people participate in no buys that means that they um there's normally a particular category either makeup body care um uh, perfumes fragrances whatever where it's an item that you've been purchasing too much and you just want to try and stop purchasing so that you can use what you already have and so that's why on my channel you've been seeing me do individual reviews you've been seeing me do project use it ups all of that is in an attempt to not do so many hauls because y'all I'm trying to save my coins and um, actually use the products that are in my collection so I'm actually in the process of filming my whole Bath and Body Works collection video and from doing that I just realized that I don't need to purchase any more items from Bath and Body Works so what I'm gonna start doing is shopping my stash y'all okay so obviously as a youtuber it's gonna be difficult for me to not purchase any items at all whatsoever from Bath and Body Works because I do film content for you all and I definitely want to make sure I'm still staying current on some of the new scents and fragrances that are being released if there is like a new collection collection that's released or a product that I feel like you know a lot of people are wanting to know more about or want to review on then I'll go ahead and purchase that item simply for the purpose of reviewing it on the channel for you all but otherwise I don't plan to really purchase any more items from Bath and Body Works at the moment um and so I guess for me it's going to be kind of a no buy slash low buy year so I'm bringing that into 2022 you all are more than welcome to join in on this journey with me um I want to do monthly check-ins um, just to see how you guys are doing and also to let you know how I'm doing to really try and hold myself accountable um, and so yeah anybody who wants to participate in the 2022 no buy from Bath and Body Works um, definitely let me know down in the comments if you guys are going to be participating or not um, I would love to have you all join in with me so that you know we can all get through our stashes and start using up some of these products that we have because I don't know about y'all but my collection is ridiculous okay and y'all will see that soon in my little collection videos that are coming up but with that I also wanted to introduce a 30 day challenge okay so at the beginning of the year Tina Marie posted on her channel on her community tab um, what type of videos uh, we wanted to see from her this year and shout out to you Tina Marie love you girl um, and with that uh, someone commented underneath that post and they said they would like to see 30 day challenges where you challenge yourself to use up a certain amount of products within 30 days I want to give a shout out to the lady who made that comment because I asked her would it be okay if I use that on my channel and she said she didn't mind and so I want to give her a shout out so her name is lioness rising so shout out to you for the great video idea because I'm implementing that on my channel so it's going to be a 30-day challenge where I'm going to use up five one two three four five six where I'm going to challenge myself to use up between maybe five and ten bath and body work products and that's just to not add so much pressure on yourself so I'm going to introduce my five products that I'll be using um first set that i want to try to get through i have a shower gel which is in hot cocoa and cream and then i also have the hot cocoa and cream body lotion so over the next 30 days i'm going to be focusing on trying to move this these this particular set out of my collection the next item that I have here is Vanilla Bean Noel. Um, Y'all know this scent has been in my collection forever and I'm just tired of it and really want it out. So I know I can't go through two full body lotions in a month, but I brought this in to this 30 day challenge in particular to try to use as a foot cream. That's been a new hack for me using foot creams um, for scent. So for scents that I don't really care about, I would normally use it as a foot cream as a way to try to go ahead and move it out of my collection. So I also have Vanilla Bean Noel. And then the last three items are items that I've already already started uh, using regularly and I just want to go ahead and challenge myself to get them finished and moving on out of my collection so um, I have um, the body oil the moisturizing body oil in Coco Shea honey really enjoy this scent a lot I do have a dedicated review of this scent on my channel so I will leave that in the description if you all want to check it out and then the last scent that I have here is Sunshine Mimosa um, and I just I'm using the scent I want to just go ahead and move it out of my collection so I, I also so with the fine fragrance mist, I feel like um, these are going to roll over to a lot of the challenges because um, I just don't go through fine fragrance mist that that uh, quickly. But um, since this one is almost gone, I figured this would be a great one to introduce in this 30 day challenge. So I have Shantan Mimosa. And then the last thing I have is a candle. So I want to try to, you know, use one item from each category. Again, I'm going for the low hanging fruit. Um, this is white mint latte. I do have a review of this item on my channel and I will leave that linked as well. But I just want to go ahead and finish this off and um, get it out of my collection 
complexion. This stuff has really good throw. This candle has been burning very, very well. It doesn't take a lot for the scent to project. I don't even have to burn it that long. So part of that is the reason why it's taking so long. And then the other part of it is I just haven't been burning candles as often. So I want to challenge myself to get back into using my candles. So white mint latte is the final item that's going to be in my 30 day challenge. If you all want to participate in the 30 day challenge with me again, go ahead and drop down in the comments. What are the five scents that you all are going to be focusing on over the next 30 days? And I want to try to also bring you all updates on this challenge so that we can all see how so that we can all see what scents we're using and moving out of our collection. Again, this is just a way for us to enjoy our collections a little bit more, shop our stashes and to make sure that we're using all the products that we purchase. So, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday and Saturday. Saturdays in particular are my bath and body work videos. So if you all like what you saw here, definitely stick around. Join the happy family. I love to have you. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye.